Well, the way that I went about doing this is kind of a combining a challenge, which is another popular launch strategy, uh, creating some type of seven-day challenge or 30-day challenge or two-week challenge, whatever it may be, along with the four-part free video series. And mixing in a little bit of Ryan Levesque's Ask Method methodology, where you're gaining additional insights from that customer based on asking them. <laughs> so you would start with our normal four-part free video series launch, which consists of three videos that are teaching content, and then your fourth video is your sales video. Along with that, incorporating some type of challenge component to it. So an example would be for my online course, Online Courses Academy. I created a, um, my launch was the online course follow-through challenge and getting people to actually uh, follow through with taking action each day. And with the four-part free video series, I also offered, gave them the opportunity to unlock bonuses if they earn points for participating in the launch. So on the launch page, you would have an example or you'd have the bonus that you could show an image of with a locked, um, a locked image on top of it. And just that, what people, they naturally want what they can't have. So even if they didn't care that much before, having that just in the forefront for them to see, oh, I can get that if I do these actions, makes it so much, them so much more likely to actually consume and engage. It's funny, psychology. I love, I love psychology. Just looking at how those things are effective. Um, so some examples of the actions that they could take were first, uh, watching the video in entirety, they earn 10 points, just joining the launch, they earn 10 points, sharing on Facebook, sharing or downloading the workbook and then commenting. So for each video, they could earn about 50 points. And then I also incorporated and took it a step further, giving them the opportunity to earn points by I had what are called surprise um, points in the email series because the hardest part with these launches is getting people to actually open the emails or whitelist your email. So if you can give some type of encouragement up front on why they should look out for your emails and open them, that's like priceless if, if it works successfully. Um, so those are the, four, the five main ways that they could earn the, the points and then more likely to consume, engage, learn your content and then ultimately purchase your paid program. All right. I so like that's it. In, a, in a nutshell. Yeah. I like, I like the, the whole, uh, you know, giving the, the locked kind of image, uh, cause people do always want what they can't have. Right. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, there's also that sense of, um, we all have that need for completion. That's why profiles work so well as a marketing strategy, like LinkedIn, there's a reason why every time you log into LinkedIn that you say, oh, your profile is 80% complete is because they want to get as much information on you as they possibly can. And we all have that need for completion. Like, I don't know if, it, if you're like this, but it irks me if it's not 100% complete. So I'm like, okay, what do I need to do to finish this profile? Um, basically handing over my whole life story to LinkedIn. Um, but it is effective. It works. 